Hello guys, Rachel here of Archaeologist. Today, we're going to do a short unboxing and also reviewing the Be Quiet Dark Rock Pro 5 Air Cooler. Let's do the unboxing. Inside the box, you will find a screwdriver, a box that contains the user's manual, the Intel backplate, brackets, screws, spacers, and thermal paste, and lastly, the Be Quiet Dark Rock Pro 5 air cooler itself. Let's go to the specifications and features. The Be Quiet Dark Rock Pro 5 has dimensions 145 by 136 by 168 millimeters and a weight of 1.29 kilograms. The Dark Rock Pro 5 is one of the newest updates for the Dark Rock Pro series of coolers. As with the previous series, it comes in all black color scheme. At the top, there's a detachable cover with Be Quiet branding at the center and mesh on the sides. We can remove the cover by pulling it out. This is being held by four magnets to keep it in place. The cooler has two modes, the quiet mode and the performance mode, which affects the speed of the two fans. The middle fan has a frame that can make the removal and installation quite easy as you will not need any fan clips anymore. The Silent Wings fan has a size of 135mm and a speed of 1300 and 1500 RPM in quiet and performance modes. The middle fan can be connected by a 4-pin fan connector. And this also has a proprietary connector for the other fan. The outer fan is Silent Wings 4 fan and has a size of 120mm with a speed of 1700 and 2000 RPM in quiet and performance mode. This fan uses traditional fan clips. This is a dual tower cooler with a ceramic coating treatment on the heat sinks. It has a cutout on the front tower to be able to give clearance for your memory modules. One of the changes of the Dark Rock Pro 5 is that the mounting plate of the cooler to the bracket is not removable, but still it uses spring tension screws. The Dark Rock Pro 5 has 7 copper heat pipes with a diameter of 6 mm. The cold plate is also made from copper with a nickel finish. If you will closely examine the heatsinks of the cooler, it has a slight curve in the design, which gives it a modern look. Let's install the air cooler. Here are my final thoughts. Based on the benchmarks, the Dark Rock Pro 5 performs well against the air coolers I tested on this channel. It's on par with the typical AK620 and much quieter, even in performance mode. Being a quiet cooler that performs well, I think, is the selling point of this cooler. Installation-wise, it's much easier than the Dark Rock Pro 4, as you don't need to access a small hole to install your cooler, and you just need to remove the middle one. 
The build quality is good too, and it really looks like a premium air cooler. It doesn't have RGB, but it's a great cooler to look at, especially in stealth builds or any builds, because of the color scheme and the heatsink cover provided by Be Quiet. But one thing I noticed, and if you also check the benchmarks, is that the Dark Rock Pro 5, even if it has 7 heat pipes, just has a little improvement over the Dark Rock Pro 4. At first, I didn't believe it and tested the cooler 5 times to see if it was really the situation. And yes, I confirm it. I also check other reviewers and my results do have the same conclusion as theirs. So, it will be hard to push this to be quiet customers in price per performance standpoint as the Dark Rock Pro 4 is a lot cheaper right now. But if you look at the aesthetic side, then yes, the Dark Rock Pro 5 is a better choice as it is sleeker and cooler to look at. Overall, the Dark Rock Pro 5 is a great cooler, has good performance, and is visually pleasing. So, I can still recommend buying this one. You can buy the Dark Rock Pro 5 for around the price of $99.90 or 5,500 pesos at your nearest Be Quiet affiliated online and physical stores. I hope this video is informational for you. For more videos, click on the subscribe button and follow my Facebook page. And see you in the next video.